when you talk about the gut getting disrupted and things like that, and that can often be a root cause for, for autoimmune conditions, do we have any idea as to why MS and why some people get a different kind of autoimmune or well, this and that? Why, you know, why? There's, there's no doubt a complicated interaction between the genes that I have and my lifetime of environmental exposures, uh, dietary choices uh, that led to the symptoms that I have. It, um, it, it's very, really very interesting that schizophrenia and multiple sclerosis have a lot of similarities. There's a high rate of um, uh, gluten sensitivity in both populations. There is uh, excess uh, uh, oxidative stress, excess and inappropriate inflammation, evidence for demyelination, evidence for neurodegeneration and brain shrinkage over time. Uh, and uh, early on in my recovery, one of my psychiatry colleagues and I did a grand rounds together uh, presenting uh, my case. Uh, and then uh, they talked about uh, the similarities between MS and schizophrenia, and they advocated for using uh, a dietary approach in the a schizophrenia clinic. Mm. And I left that thinking like, man, I am so lucky that my uh, symptoms developed into MS and not schizophrenia. Because I have an aunt that has schizophrenia. Uh, and uh, you know, a couple of uncles uh, with some mental health issues. I, and so I'm, I'm very, I feel extraordinarily blessed. Hmm. Can people with autoimmune conditions be cured or do you think it's just a lifelong so, uh, change? Uh, when you have an autoimmune condition, <clears throat> your genes have interacted with your environment. You have this inappropriate immune disorder that is now attacking various organs. Uh, and if you don't get to the root cause, you'll develop another new autoimmune diagnosis about every 10 years. If you get to the root cause of what are all the environmental factors that contribute to your immune cells attacking your organs, you can reduce your symptoms, um, likely have dramatic improvement in quality of life, likely reduce your need for prescription medication, quite likely reduce your need for immune suppressing medication. But if you go back to those previous environmental factors, everything will come back. 